We are flipping today, guys. In fact, this is probably gonna be our final flip in House Flipper 1 because House Flipper 2 comes out really soon. So we're gonna be buying another house. And at the end of the last episode, I asked you guys which house you think we should get for our final flip. I told you that I was leaning towards the beach house, but I do keep your feedback in the comments in mind. If you leave a comment, I'm reading it, okay? If you leave a comment, I'm reading it. So thank you so much for leaving your comments in my videos. I really appreciate it. Someone said that house that is hiding something has a special kind of secret within it. They said, I'm not gonna tell you what it is, but it will definitely get you some money. And I don't know, something about that just was really intriguing to me. So I don't know, I wanna run a poll. And the options are summer house, turtle house, the beach house, and house that is hiding something. The poll is officially running. You guys have two minutes. Oh wait, we can look inside too. Oh wow. Why does it say make house on the front of it? This reminds me of like, it's like the fucking team 10 house or something. Oh, okay. House that is hiding something. What is it hiding? Seriously, what is it hiding? All right, you guys, the votes are in. And house that is hiding something has won. Let's find out what this house is hiding. I'm actually scared. <laughs> All right, well, let me take a look on the outside. Looks like this place has gotten vandalized. I'm real. oh, I have my flamethrower. We gotta cut the grass, okay? We have to cut the grass. Ah, oh, f I'm out of fuel. <laughs> I'm like wasting all my money on fuel. Oh! Oh my god, I would have died there. If this was real life, I would have died. That's why I fucking hate video games, you guys. So unrealistic. Oh my god, I would have died again. I literally just died twice. Okay, this is also a little unrealistic. Why won't these... This is just me procrastinating to see what this house is hiding. Because honestly, I'm scared. Like, I don't know. Uh, I'm just... I'm having anxiety. Anybody else having anxiety or just me? I'm building suspense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my god, this place is a fucking dump. I'm gonna need a lot of fuel. Everyone always tells me to get like the garden expansion pack, but why? I don't need it. I'm mowing the grass right now. I wonder what the neighbors think. You know, that's a good question. I just moved in, just bought this house. And I'm running around my yard with a flamethrower. Okay, just about done. Oh wait, look at this. The buyers are loving it. Wait, the house looks so much better already. All right, let's go ahead and clean up this graffiti because I don't know, honestly, I just think this is a little disrespectful this, that this is on the outside of my home. Okay, wow. The outside of the house is looking amazing already. So let's get in there, you guys. Oh shit, I think I just died. <laughs> That's one way to clean up in here, right? Okay, that was easy. Wait, what is... What is the- is this what the house is hiding, you guys? Is that hair coming out of the vent? I'll just clean that up really quick. Let me get my flamethrower back out for this room. <laughs> oh, um... I just burnt the bed. Well, we will probably get a new bed anyway, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's mop the walls now. Let's do a little mopping. Jen, <laughs> stop using the flamethrower unless you- don't want your surprise. Did I burn it already? Okay, all right, I'll stop with the flamethrower. Okay, I don't wanna burn my surprise, that'd be so annoying. All right, let's clean these windows. Let's 
get some fresh air in here. The surprise is that no one will buy it. Fuck. Did I just buy a lemon? <gasps> oh, I can't go down there yet. I can't go down there yet. I'm so scared. Oh my god. I'm actually gonna vomit live on stream. I just know the surprise is in the basement. Like, come on. It has to be. Okay. No secret in here. Why do I feel like I'm playing a horror game? Like this is actually freaking me out. I'm scared. I'm gonna uh, just fix the electricity really quick. So no surprise. I will say, I see on the map here that there is another room back here. Looks like if we um, break down this wall, there might be something that the house is hiding. What is that? Is that a block of cheese? Is that a block of cheese, you guys? I think that... Oh my god, it's a big block of Swiss cheese. Starry Night by Van Gogh. Oh my god. No way. No way. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm rich. I'm rich. I'm rich. in here bringing the whole wall down my god is this the original oh my god the fucking the painting starry night by van gogh i feel like i'm in storage wars right now i just hit the jackpot and this like i've never seen this chair in the game before let me just sit in this really quick no because what was going on in this room you guys just a room with a chair facing starry night all right, you guys, moment of truth. Oh my God. Oh my God. I'm rich. I'm rich. Fifty-six, $56,000? Damn, this chair is $1,000 in itself. $56,000. 
Oh my god. Guys, this is more money than we've ever made from any job, any flip. Just sitting down here in the basement. I'm not gonna lie, I was expecting a little bit more. I mean, this is Starry Night by Van Gogh, and I'm assuming this is the original, but it must not be, because I feel like the original we get millions. But I don't know, $56,000? Like, this house was $100,000, so we just got about $60,000 of our investment back already. I mean, this is a this is a major W. Everyone put Ws in the chat right now. What do you mean L? I'm kind of scared to even sell it, like... I don't know, it's just so magical and mystical. Let me inspect this painting. Oh my God, I, I need to go get some fresh air outside. I'm freaking out over this discovery. Whew. Oh my God, I forgot that was there. I think I just died again. Let me go back down here and look at this again. Wow, like what? What the hell? Okay, listen, I know some people in their chat are telling me to keep it and I do feel an urge to keep it. Like when there's something like really like nice and valuable like this, like I don't wanna sell it, but. Guys, come on. Let's take the 60K. And exactly, someone in the chat said it's fake because the real Starry Night is worth over a hundred million dollars. So this is just an amazing replica. Wait, should we, should we burn? Okay, no, 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 no. We'll sell it, we'll sell it, we'll sell it. No, we're definitely selling it, you guys. It's really cool, it's cute, but we're definitely selling this because we get more than half of what we invested into this house right back off the beginning. That is an amazing, amazing deal. I'm loaded, I'm rich, I'm selling it all. And we're gonna start from scratch. Okay, so now it's time to think of a theme. What should we do for this house? Any suggestions in the chat? Should we just do like a normal house and make it really cute? Or should we do like a theme? Last time we tried to do a pink house, but there wasn't many pink items in the game. So we ended up with a black pink house, which was equally as iconic. Buy butcher shop. What about that? What if we did, we filled the house with buy pride colors and canned meatballs. Raw beef buy nursing home. Whoa. Ketchup house. Sewer themed. Oh, what's this? Wait, I have a new perk. I didn't even notice this. We have to do price negotiation because I mean, we're doing our flip here. So if we can increase our chance of a successful negotiation by 15%, yes. I am really leaning towards buy butcher shop. Like something so funny about like doing like a buy themed house with meatballs, cans everywhere but I'm also liking nursing home. Buy nursing home where they only feed the senior citizens meatballs. Let's see what the buyers want. And I think it might give us a clearer idea of what to do. Oh my God. Okay, so we've got family Johnson. There's like 47 of them in the family. They want a decent kitchen in the house. They want rugs, they like wooden furniture, and they don't wanna pay the extra for expensive furniture. I'm not really liking that last note from them because I want my buyer to be rich. We need a big comfortable bed, more bedrooms are needed, there's no big family room, there's no children. I don't think this house is for you guys, okay? There's literally like 45 too many of you. Okay, so he just wants a bed, a desk, and bookshelves. Who's our richest buyer here? This guy wants a sauna. I don't understand what I need this kitchen for. He doesn't want a kitchen in his house? That is a little bizarre. Who, which one of you guys has a lot of money? This guy looks like he has a lot of money. 40 years old investor buying houses for rent. He's ruining uh, the housing market. So he probably has a ton of money. Lately, there are loads of Norwegians here. They took they look for houses and pay heavily for renting one, but only if there is an in-home sauna. Well, I don't know like if I'm liking that. Wait, these people might be great. The Smoth family, they want one bedroom, but two would be better, okay? 
It's a young family with a newborn child. You could go after the smarts. Wait, who's this? Oh my god. He wants to protect his family at all costs, even if he needs to kill someone? Um... Well, if we went the route where we put, like, a ton of guns everywhere, I think he would definitely be a buyer for us. Okay, we could also go after Veronica here. Loves non-conventional stuff. Wait, this might be our buyer, you guys, because if we decide to do a buy butcher nursing home, that's pretty unconventional. And I think she would like that. Okay, let's go after the smoths. I saw someone in the chat say smoth family vlogs. I like where your head's at. Let's make a house for the family vloggers, the small family. I'll make sure to put a computer room for your live streaming, your newborn baby. Yes, oh my God, yeah. We'll put a computer live streaming room in the basement so they can live stream the birth of their newborn baby and live stream every day with their baby and just show the internet raising their child. Okay, let's get some walls going here. Make a birthing room, yes. Birthing room with a live streaming camera in front of it. Ooh, I like this color. I feel like the smots are gonna want like a YouTuber-esque house that's really like clean, like a, sad, like a sad beige house. You know what I'm saying? Sad beige for their sad beige baby that they're gonna live stream. Let's go ahead with the beige. We're gonna give them a, mo a modern farmhouse. Which ironically, I own a modern farmhouse, you guys. I am a content creator as well. So let's just go ahead and... <laughs> Wait, what the? We can't just paint over this? You need a bucket of plaster to fill the hole in the wall? I thought we were doing the landlord special. Oh my God. Wait, this is kind of exciting. Put our plaster down. Oh my God, wait, this is exciting. Oh, wait, I love that. I'm gonna plaster everything. <sighs> wow, baby's first plaster. Oh my God, I love this. <laughs> I know you guys can't see it, but one of the buyers just said there is still one hole left. Like, calm down. I'm getting to it, okay? And what's wrong with the hole, by the way? All right. Oh, wait. I hallucinated. <gasps> oh my God, I hallucinated. Because I thought there were two bedrooms on this floor. Where is the Smoth family gonna put their baby's room? Because in my head I was thinking, this is gonna be their room, the bathroom, then downstairs we're gonna have the birthing room with a live streaming setup and a bathroom down here. Should we put the baby's room down here with the live streaming setup as well? Like with their camera equipment? Oh, someone in the chat said the backyard. We could put the baby in the backyard. Yes, they can watch the baby sleep on YouTube. <laughs> I'm subscribing to the small family vlogs. Let's just go back to painting the walls and then we'll troubleshoot that later, okay? Worst case scenario, we can make the baby's room in the basement, like where the Van Gogh painting was. And it'll be like easy live streaming, like access for their family vlogs. They'd be canceled for putting the baby in the basement. That'll be their first scandal. When their viewers find out that they keep the baby in the basement. First scandal. <laughs> 3 a.m. unethical birthing challenge. <laughs> 24-7 baby live stream so viewers tweet at you when the baby needs something. You know what, that's not a bad idea for family vloggers. Like they could get the internet to be their babysitter. This doesn't even look beige, by the way. Anybody else think it's really gray? I mean, okay, to be fair, the paint color was gray beige, but to me this just looks really gray. I don't mind the color TBH. It's actually, it's a nice like, I mean, it's a nice basic color, you know? I think we gotta change the color of these doors though. We need something sadder and beigeier. These are a little bit too colorful. I don't know, what do you think? Should we do white? Yeah, I think we might have to go with white. Wait guys, I always f up the doors. Okay. Okay, I got it. Whew! Let's go ahead and, and change the front door too. Oh sh**. All right, I wasn't expecting there to not be a hole here. 
Okay. Wait, what happened? <laughs> what happened? Why is it so far out? Wait, is that normal? Oh, it's norm. Why is it? Why does it look normal from the outside, you guys, but weird on the inside? Hold on. F I'm stuck inside again. <laughs> it looks the same. <sighs> Maybe it always looked like that, but I just didn't realize. Wait, I feel like it, I don't know. I'm so confused. I'm literally hallucinating right now. Wait, can I sell this? Wait, I just sold- Okay, I just have to place it down. For everyone saying use the scroll wheel, if I do the scroll wheel, it flips the door the other way, which the door can only go one way because there's a knocker on one side because it's the front door. So we all just have to get over it. Okay. I put this, wait. I put the door frame on the inside. It looks so weird when you open it. I was trying to sell the frame, not the door again. There's not enough, r wait, now it's telling me I can't. It's telling me I can't put it there anymore. What is going on? Oh, the door's still here. What is going on? All right, hold on, hold on. I'm just burning the whole house down. Oh, f I'm out of fuel. What is happening? Okay. <laughs> okay, wait, wait. I'm trying it again. I've only spent fing $3,000 on doors, but let's try it one more time. Okay, okay. All right. I'm over it. That's what the door looks like. I'm literally over it. Let's replace these doors now. Oh my God, I'm so sick of doors. At least these ones are kind of normal, you know? Oh my God. Stop. Not someone that's testing. You can see the concrete from the inside. Please stop telling me that. I'm freaking out. Oh my God, I f***ed this door up too. Can I move it? Oh my God, I have to sell it. I'm spending all my Van Gogh Starry Night money. Okay, there we go. Oh my God, it's a... It's the wrong way. I'm freaking out. Oh my God. I'm looking at the chat right now and people are saying the other door is the same way, which I looked at right here and it, it is. So now I'm looking to the left over here and... Which... I just feel like... I 
I don't, I'm, let me do this tour. Oh, which way do we do it? No! No! <laughs> no! <laughs> the sound effect, I'm f***ing dying. What the hell? Is this right? It looks wrong. The deck is on the inside. Okay, wait, wait, wait. I think I gotta do the other way. This game's giving me a f***ing migraine. Oh my god. Okay, like this. Okay. That's right, that's right, that's right, that's right, that's right. This is how I'm trying to be with all the other doors in the house. Now, <laughs> I'm turning around and losing my mind. What is going on back here? Okay, so for everyone saying flip the front door, the only problem is this Front door has a knocker on the outside, which is why it can be flipped. But I think I'm, I cannot stand the fact that we can see the sidewalk from the inside of the house. So I feel like we should just give up on the knocker. Every time I say knocker, I keep thinking like knockers, like tits. Maybe we just have to do a normal door, but it is bothering me that this is internal door. Like I feel like this might not look right from the outside. Let me out. Oh my god. Oh my god. Why is it inside the house? Okay, it's Christmas. I don't give a f it's Christmas. Why is this happening? And I'm compromising too with Christmas. Why is this happening to me? I'm about to quit. I'm nauseated. I think they're just gonna use the back door to get inside for right now. And now we got another problem. Which way did the doors go? Does it go like this? Or does it go like this? Everyone let me know. Did the doors go option one? Or did the doors go option two? Option two. Okay, so we're just gonna switch this then. White door, interior. Okay. 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 That looks, that looks normal. That looks normal. I think, I think. Now let's get these knockers back in the house. And this is what I'm gonna do, okay? I'm putting it, oh, oh. What about here? Literally, f it. F it. it. Let's see if we can put like a little mat in the front. Like maybe like welcome mat. This is so good for them. Beige. <laughs> it's too fucking long. I wanted to put it here so we could cover the concrete. Okay, there, 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 there. There we go. Should we do a different shade of beige for the bedroom? Should we do natural beige for the bedroom? That's really spicing it up actually, because we did gray beige. 
out in the living room. Look how different that is. That's really... Yeah, that's really spicing things up. I almost feel like this is a little too crazy for the bedroom though. Like, maybe we should do something like... Ooh, what about green tea? Oh, <gasps> green tea. Wait, what's going on in the... Do you guys see like all this fog in here? What's going on with the fog in the house? These colors that we've got for the house, like the palette, just so colorful and beautiful. Oh wait, I actually love this color. Not even joking around, this is nice. Wow. <sighs> wow. This is amazing. I feel like this is a good bathroom color though. You know what I'm saying? Like, isn't this such a nice bathroom color? Wow, it's Gorgina. Absolutely Gorgina in the bathroom here. I hope the smoths like this. Like, it is a little colorful. I don't know if this really fits their aesthetic, but I'm just trying something crazy. I'm, I'm hoping, going on a whim here, hoping they'll like it. Hey, queen, girl, you have done it again. Constantly placing that front door for us all and doing it flawlessly. <laughs> so I'm going back in with the white for the bedroom. I just feel like the green tea, like it, it's really crazy. So I want to do it for a small room, like the bathroom. It also is giving good bathroom vibes. Maybe we could do an accent wall in this room. Like on the, what's, what's that? What is that? like a, a beige accent wall. I mean, I know it's a bit of a crazy color for an accent, but I don't know. I'm just trying new things for this moths. I'm trying new things. It's a little crazy though. I hope they like it. We've got this radiator mount here, but I'm sorry, the moths, they've got central AC, okay? So I'm selling that. And now we've just gotta replace these floors. They're a little too dark. They're not really going in with the, you know, the modern farmhouse vibe that we're going for here. So let's see. Oh, wait. Oh, we need to paint more. That is the upgrade we need. Light nut could be good. What do you guys think about light nut? You guys like light nut? Like a little light nut? Let's just do like a test of light nut. Uh, a little too colorful. I don't know, may wait, maybe. Oh, uh, actually. Actually. Wait, let me just see my other options though. Oh, what about Japanese elm? No, 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 no. What about elk beige panels? It's got the key word, beige. it's the lights or what but I don't know it's bright what about gray gray <laughs> oh my god I'm liking light nut like the best out of all of these so far where'd my mat go oh there it is where'd it go Oh, there it is. Where'd it go? That's right there. All right, let's go in with the French knot in here as well. Slayage. Slayage, mama. And then in the bathroom, we need tiles, obviously. I mean, we could go for just white here. Let's see what this looks like. It'll probably look good, I mean. Yeah, I mean, it looks good. I'm liking it. This is every family vlogger's dream home, you guys. I had a little French nut last week. Oh, this honestly can stay. This is perfect. 
This needs to go though, but I'm not onto that right now. I'm still doing, I'm doing the bones of the house. You know, we got to do the bones of the house before we go in with all the furniture. So far, this is looking good. Although these lamps are fugly. I like these though. Bring one of these in here. God, it's so bright. I can't even look at this. This is gonna be good for our kitchen, I think. And for like the living room, I'm just gonna leave that as it is for now. <laughs> I feel like I'm in in heaven me too what is going on it's bright as hell in here but that is true someone in the chat said they need good lighting for the vlogs let's get down into the basement you guys the basement needs a lot of work because these bricks are not gonna cut it but what i do think could cut it actually for the basement are these bricks yep Like, I kind of love this, like, unironically. Yes! <laughs> this family is going to blend into this house. You will never be able to tell when looking through the window if they're home or not. So true, to be honest. I forgot about shiplap, you guys. What the hell is shiplap? Okay, you guys, I have some in my, my room right here. Oh my god, I'm actually... I'm sad... Beige influencer. It's this. It's wooden panels on the wall. Oh wait, this is beige. Too much color. Too much color. Oh, here we go. This is what I'm talking about. This is what I'm talking about. Yeah, <laughs> yes. Yes. Do the horizontal ones. Oh wait, they have horizontal ones? Oh, wait. Wait. Ah. <gasps> yes. Yes. Okay, back to stone. This is the dungeon, I mean, uh, baby's room and stream room and where they'll keep their filming equipment and stuff, where they film their like vlogs. <laughs> the birthing room. <laughs> this is where they pop out all their babies. They do home births so they can film them. It's so white in here. Okay, so there's stuff in here for a bathroom already. And then we've got this like mystery room, which I feel like we can turn this into like the baby's room. Like the bathroom doesn't need to be that big, I feel like, right? So we could go. We need a kiddie pool for the births. Oh my God, this is so colorful. Can we move this? Or can we just sell it? Oh wait, oh, there we go. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> All right, we need our dungeon door. Oh wait, it can build three walls at once. I need that. Uh, wait, did I say, I meant uh, just, just bedroom and bathroom door, not dungeon, sorry. I didn't mean to, I don't know why. One. Oh my. <sighs> okay, 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 got it. And then we need another door for the baby's dungeon. I mean, Bedroom. I feel like here's a good spot for a door. <laughs> Just ignore, th ignore that up there. Damn it. Okay, I have to knock this all down and then add lentils or whatever. So where my tiles at? Perfect. Now for the floor, I feel like let's bring a little life to this uh, basement and bring the French nut down here. We don't have to go so industrial just because it's a basement, you know? Holy sh**, why are they like yellow? Is it because the lights are off? Please tell me. Why is it yellow? That has to change. I think we maybe need to go to gray hardwood. I mean, 
this is where they're gonna be live streaming and like showing a lot of their home off. So we really wanted to be uh, personality-less. And it's time for the sad beige baby's room, which, oh wait, I saw beige carpet, which listen, I know, um, no one really likes carpet in their homes anymore. People, it's all about the hard wood, but I think this is perfect for baby because we don't want baby to, you know, fall out of the crib and hit the hardwood floor. Like if they fall out of the crib, they'll be hitting carpet. Now we're going in with our beige walls. This will be really stimulating for baby. No outlet for baby. We don't want baby to electrocute themselves. This is literally looking like a prison. All right, let's get to work on the bathroom over here. Let's do white tiles again. Wait, is this already on the floor? No, okay, it's different white tiles. And this time we did like this light green upstairs. Let's go for like a light blue downstairs, like sky blue. <laughs> I don't know, this might be a little bit too colorful. Let's just see how it looks on the walls. Ooh, I don't, I don't know. It's more colorful than I thought it was gonna be. I think when we install lights in here and turn them on, it'll look less blue. I don't know, I'm worried. It's a little much. There we go. That's what I was expecting. Baby needs a little light in here, not getting any natural light from the windows, so important that baby gets some light in here. There we go. Okay, now let's change the stairs. Yep, white wood. Perfect. Guys, this place is looking amazing. This place is looking amazing. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah, this is looking amazing. I did the whole bones of the house. Look at this, guys. We've got the grass is cut, the outside is beautiful, and we've done everything inside. So when we play next time, we are ready to furnish this house. And I just know the Smoths are gonna love it, you guys. They are gonna love it. Well, you guys, I hope you have enjoyed that flip so far. It was basically uh, two hours of putting doors down. Anyway, you guys, uh, thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next episode. Bye YouTube.